As dawn broke over the Cree nation of Mysticini in northern Quebec, a team of bleary-eyed Concordia students watched their dreams take flight. This is insane. The first rocket launch ever from Quebec and from Cree soil. The goal was to reach space, and while it fell short, it was still a triumph. It's been a project that has been going on for like seven years, and seeing it, you know, it's, it's entirely built by students, and it's kind of like crazy to see innovation kind of happening in front of your eyes. The team faced many hurdles to reach this moment, like the pandemic. Through COVID, you know, students had to, to even test the engine for leaks in their own bathtubs. Then there was the delicate journey to the remote launch site, hundreds of kilometers north of Montreal, plus Mother Nature's challenges. We've been sleeping in tents for about three weeks, uh, going through freezing rain, snow, uh, crazy winds, being eaten alive by back flies. Uh, we wouldn't be doing this if we didn't love it. The partnership with the Cree nation of Mysticini became something larger. The students looked for ways to integrate that culture. They had this, you know, uh, wanted to come up with a name, you know, a Cree name for, for their rocket. And so, you know, we had Star Sailor, you know, but it's uh, in Cree, we also called it uh, Chikabesh. Chikabesh means star boy. Back in Montreal, this proud professor watched the launch from home with his son. He says the students showed what's possible, even without NASA's multi-billion dollar budget. We are able to do this in Canada. It is, uh, it is being done by students. And I hope this message gets heard by everybody around Canada. Proof that determination can take anyone to new heights and inspire the next generation of minds. Jayla Bernstein, CBC News, Montreal.